Good day, everybody. My name is Jimmy. I'm here with a really quick fix for you guys. I'm hoping it reaches a lot of people because I've had this problem for over a year and there are no solutions out there that I could find. Um, if you have a problem where you cannot or all of a sudden your multi-selection functionality goes away, um, you'll see how much you miss it when it suddenly disappears on you. What am I talking about? When you click on something and you press the command button on my keyboard like I'm doing right now, I'm going to select another item. It does not select, right? Usually it's very easy to do this kind of thing. And I use it all the time, especially when I'm editing videos or pictures, right? You want to select several things at one time and then drag them to your trash or whatever, things like that. You can lasso them all together like this, but you, sometimes you don't want these items. Sometimes you want very specific items, and that's where the multi-selection comes into place. Also, my shift functionality would disappear as well, where I could press a button and shift on my way down in a finder window with a lot of contents in that window, for example. Um, so what the hell happened over a year ago? It just suddenly disappeared. I didn't really think much about it back then, but as the months wore on, I was like, man, I really want this to be fixed. Did I do something to my computer? I could not figure it out. Um, so yeah, what, what could I do, right? And I tried everything. I went to preferences. I looked on the internet for different solutions, everyone's solutions as to restarting, uh, recalibrating your mouse, um, bring everything back to default, the way your trackpad works. I've tried everything many, many times. It was so frustrating until maybe about a week ago I decided I'm gonna fix this thing once and for all how am I gonna fix this thing maybe I should just uh, erase my computer completely maybe I should uh, trash my computer and throw it against the wall perhaps I don't know um, I didn't have a warranty so I didn't know how to fix this thing and no one could help me so here is what I ended up doing and that ended up fixing it finally I kinda wanna kick myself in the face for it but I'm gonna try and give you guys three seconds here to figure out what do you think the problem was ready go Okay, if you have not figured it out, I didn't tell you about this one very crucial piece of information on purpose, because I didn't know at the time there's no way you deserve that sort of advantage over me. So here is the thing that I didn't tell you guys. I bought an external mouse. It was something cheap off of Amazon. It connects by Bluetooth to my computer by USB. And in order to calibrate it, what I did was I downloaded a program called Better Touch Tool. That's this thing right here. In the top right hand corner I'm pointing to it right now. Better Touch Tool is something that I use to calibrate the mouse and you open the program you kind of set it and forget it type of thing and that's pretty much it. It's just a mouse okay no big deal. What I didn't know was that this interferes with your multi-selection functionality on your keep on your trackpad on your Mac in general because I'm not able to do it. Watch what happens when I quit Better Touch Tool. I'm going to select an item, press the command button right now, and I'm going to select another item. Hallelujah, the functionality has returned miraculously. It's truly amazing and um, it's, it's awesome. Why didn't I figure this out more than a year ago? Because no one else ever talked about it. Perhaps no one else knew that it was that right there and it caused them to go crazy. So if you use Better Touch Tool, if you use another mouse calibration type of software that you've downloaded, you may think it's small, you may think it has nothing to do with anything. Oh, believe me, it's that one thing that will drive you crazy for over a year. So definitely check out what, you're, what you think the problem could be. It could be very much something as small as a mouse calibration program you downloaded. Okay, and when I'm in a finder window, for example, there's a list of contents, I can do the same thing now. So it's all back to normal. And uh, if I were to turn on Better Touch Tool, I can do it with my mouse, I think. But I don't have my mouse with me all the time. In fact, I hardly even use it. I use it when I'm editing extensively, but usually I'm just using the trackpad. So I want this to be with me at all times, this sort of functionality here, you know what I mean? So I hope this helps you guys. I want this to go out there in terms of a great solution that people are unaware of. And because the preferences thing does not work, this is a solution for me. And I know it's going to be a solution for a lot of you out there. Thank you very much for watching. I'll talk to you soon. If you have any questions, uh, please post them. If you have any uh, anything else, any success stories, I'd love to hear it. Uh, I would love to uh, help you guys with some of your frustrations out there. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.